one, I have a Shop Miss A haul to do. I haven't purchased anything from Shop Miss A in a while, and as with any YouTube videos, once you start watching someone else's video and they have a haul from somewhere or you see something you like, I don't know, it's just you automatically feel like you have to go shopping. So that is precisely what I did. I hadn't been on the website in a while, so I went to check it out and I seen something interesting right away. So I purchased 10 things and everything on their site is only a dollar. So, you know, you're getting, you can fill up your shopping cart fairly quickly and you're still not spending a whole lot. So I purchased 10 things and shipping is $3.95. So I spent $13.95 all together and I think I got some good stuff. So I want to show you guys what I decided to pick out. My one beef, I guess you'd say, with Shop Miss A is that their stuff comes sometimes in like different colors and stuff like that, even like jewelry, makeup, whatnot. And once it's sold out, they don't really take it off the site. So you get all excited like, oh yeah, I love that necklace. I want it in this color. And then you actually click on it and they don't have it in that color. They only have it in, you know, a few other colors. So that's my only problem with it, that they don't um, delete products that are sold out. So you don't necessarily know that it's sold out until, you know, you click on it. So you get excited for nothing pretty much. <laughs> but um, I do notice that they sometimes restock things. So just because it's sold out now doesn't necessarily mean it is out of stock forever. So enough ramble. Um, this is a haul video and I want to show you guys what I purchased. So I got the one, the main thing that caught my interest right away was this Thing here this is called a brush cleaning egg and it is by AOA studio now I don't have anything like this normally I just clean my makeup brushes with a little bit of Johnson's baby shampoo and I just you know use my hands to soap them up and rinse them out so I don't have anything like this I was seeing people using like silicone um, kind of like mats that you can buy. I've seen people buy them at Dollar Tree and then you just like rub them across like the nubby bits on the silicone mat. Well here I guess they came out with an like a what they call an egg. So basically you just kind of hold it in two fingers or whatever and then you rub your brush along this you know after you have it all soaked up and wet and everything like that. So I figured I'd give this a try. I was curious and for only a dollar, I mean, if I don't like it, it's not like the biggest deal, but I thought it seemed like it'd be pretty good quality and it really is. It's a very thick um, silicone rubber and two fingers fit in there very nicely. Um, so I am very anxious to try this out. Got that and I purchased this Beauty Treats Peach Oxygen Bubble Mask. I have never used a bubble mask, but again, it was something I had seen before. I think on like a Facebook video, I want to say. Um, and when I was looking at their site a while ago, this was sold out. And some of the other scents are sold out, but um, this one was available, so I nabbed it. And I did not realize, but this has two masks. You can kind of tear it apart right here. And there's one mask here, one mask there. I was under the impression it was just one mask. So you're actually getting two masks for a dollar. So that's pretty cool. Um, like I said, this is the bubble mask. I don't quite know um, what it does exactly. I might do a demo of this though to show you guys. I haven't decided yet, but I picked that up. I only purchased one piece of jewelry. I have a ton of jewelry and it's mainly because I go to yard sales, I find jewelry for a quarter here, 50 cents there, and it really like adds up into my jewelry box. So I know yard sale season is coming and I'm probably gonna be picking up more jewelry. So I only purchased one piece of jewelry and I got this necklace and I thought this would be really cute. Hold up, I think this one's messed up. Is it? No, okay, I thought one of the whatchamacallits was messed up. All right, so this is the only necklace I got and it's just on this gold chain with these black um, fringy bits. And I thought this would be really cute with like a plain white top. I thought it would pop rather nicely. So I got that. I mean, it's 
their jewelry is kind of um, you know what you'd expect for a dollar it's not horrible some of the pieces I have gotten in the past have broke um, you know they're not meant to last you're only paying a dollar for them so I mean it's nice to just like try out different styles and stuff like that but again like the pieces probably are not gonna last forever so I got that um, next thing I bought um, they sell all sorts of cute little um, just stationary things and I saw these and I thought they were so freaking cute I had to get them it's basically a sticky note memo pad and then it has these smaller ones here and they're just cute little sheepies and I just thought they were so cute so you get 20 sheets on the memo pad and then 20 sheets on each um, sticky tag pad so I just thought so adorable and they had different um, animals of these but I fell in love with the baths so I got those and then I also got a cute little pen because it was a kitty cat and I had to get it I mean how cute is that it's just a pink cat uh, crazy long neck here um, actually his whole body is pretty much his neck and then he's got a little tail with his feet where the actual pen is and you know what we're gonna test this out and see how well it writes using one of the memo pads because the one thing I absolutely hate is buying a cute nice new pen and then it not write very well or not write at all so we're going to see oh this is like um this is like a rollerball gel pen this writes really smooth and nice so I like that I really do that's a cute pen and is gonna be my newest favorite so I got that I got two nail polishes I did not need nail polish but the pictures of these kind of just popped out at me and I decided to pick them up these are both by the brand clean color and the first one I got is teal envy and that's what's on my nails currently though it's all chipping off I did not put a top coat on so that's probably why um, as far as the nail polish goes though it was okay the brush was nice the, the nail polish is a little goopy but you know again for a dollar um, I think I put on two coats of this you might have been able to get away with just one but I like to put two on and then the other one I got is again by clean color and this one's called love for pudding and what sold me on this is that it's scented and I'm like oh my god pudding scented nail polish I have to have that so I I haven't actually like obviously ugh, obviously if you smell it right from the bottle it smells like pure nail polish so I would not do that unless you are looking to get high on nail polish fumes so I'm just gonna sit that there and let it dry and then I will let you know if it does in fact smell like pudding so got that one I got a couple of makeup items. The first thing I got was this eyeshadow quad. This is by a brand called Princessa. And they had all different um, colors of this. This one is the one in Mexico City. And it comes in like a cardboard packaging. And there's a mirror on the lid. Sorry if I'm blinding you. And then these are the shadows. And I already did swatch them. Um, it did not come to me like this. But it comes with three shadows. And this reminded me of the old Stila eyeshadow packaging. Um, actually, this is a trio, not a quad. I apologize. But um, it reminded me of the old Stila packaging. So I'm just going to swatch these for you guys so you can see what they look like. They feel pretty soft. And they're very pigmented. So this, these are the colors here. So they're nice neutral shades, just the type of eyeshadow that I would wear. So I got those, and then I also got a, and everything comes in like cute little bags and stuff like that, and say Miss A. So I got this Clean Color Master Strokes Longwear Matte Lipstick. I currently have this on my lips right now. This is the shade Bubblegum Pink. And I'll swatch that for you as well. That is the color right there. So this is pretty creamy and smooth. So, and it smells like grapes. 
surprised me, but it does have a great scent. The last thing I got was this Beauty Treats Lip Scrub in Vanilla Bean, and they had different um, flavors of this, but I was just curious about it. And it's, I haven't tried it yet, but it's actually kind of creamy, like it's not like, um, it's not like the lip scrubs that you see at Lush where it's more like um, chunks of like sugar crystals. This is actually like in some form of cream consistency with like little bits in there that scrub your lips. They're walnut shells um, in there that are what scrub your lips. So I got that to try out. And that is everything that I purchased um, this time from Shop Miss A. Uh, probably will be a while until I purchase again unless something else comes up that I just need to try. I saw after I purchased this little, oh it is full of my hair, how disgusting. After I had purchased this little egg here, I noticed that they started selling um, this AOA brand in um, beauty blenders. So again, I'm not sure how they are, but they're only a buck. So that is my haul. I hope you guys enjoyed and I will see you next time.